Hey, welcome back to the Caribou Data Science Channel. This is the afternoon of Friday, Ju July the 1st, 2022. And you're five minutes away from your weekending COVID-19 analysis, as you see in this screen above. So we'll be back here in five minutes, okay? Okay, so what do we need here? We need 
another seam. Sorry about this little delay here. Okay, I'll come back and I'll fix the camera later on. <laughs> Let's get the show on the road here now, okay? I'll be the I'll be the mystery host. That's it. Yeah. So let's start out with Brazil. We say welcome back, Brazil, to your Caribou Data Science Channel. This is the afternoon of uh, Friday, July the first, twenty twenty-two. And as always, we begin with Brazil. We Brazil, uh, Spain. Oh, I don't know. Uh, India, Israel, Portugal, Sweden, and finally the U.S. So you, can see, you can see for the previous 365 days, uh, Brazil has had 13.7 million cases, 153,000 plus deaths. Uh, let's see, Sweden's, uh, Sweden's, okay, good. Just making sure of that. Okay, so you can see that Sweden's uh, number of cases for the Avari past 2022 cases. Good news is for, uh, for Sweden, Brazil, Brazil's uh, 2022 cases have already passed. The total cases are 2021. And you can see here that uh, you can see here that uh, the good news is that the 2022 COVID 19 deaths for Brazil have not caught 2021's total COVID 19 deaths. And you can see they did have a big long downtrend here, but as of uh, as of six twenty seven, they were averaging fifty six thousand four hundred sixty two cases per day, and they're averaging two hundred seventeen point two deaths per day based on the seven day average. And you can see the increase in COVID nineteen cases here over the last few weeks, and there has been a bit of a spike here in COVID nineteen. Uh, Deaths also fall in very low numbers down to here. 
And you can see, unfortunately, uh, that uh, cases is going to be the, the, the month, the, 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 the most number of cases in the previous four months. And deaths are going to be the, the number of deaths, the more, most deaths out of the previous three months, okay? So that concludes uh, Sweden's uh, magic numbers for today. So let's wrap this up here. Mm -hmm. Let's keep this this wagon moving along here now, Sweden, or now with uh, with uh, Spain. Our report for Spain now. You can see your Spain for the previous 365 days have had 8.9 million cases. 27,210 deaths. And for the year, you see that the 22 COVID 19 cases for Spain have already passed 2021's numbers. And unfortunately, uh, the 2022 deaths, COVID 19 deaths, have already passed the total number for 2021. We can see the numbers are still a little bit, you know, still had a, had a very large declining pattern here. And as of 620, as of 625, Spain's averaging 17,200 cases per day, and 43.1 deaths per day. The numbers are still fairly low over here, under 125,000 you know, 125, or less all the way over to here. Let's count that as a victory. And again, the overall pattern for COVID-19 deaths in, in Spain does appear to be downward, okay? Now, what this means is, Well, this means that June, June was one of the lowest months of the previous uh, six months, okay? Obviously, these, these numbers here as well, yeah. this is very close. Nonetheless, nonetheless the, the cases were under, under 500,000 for the month of June. Look at this. Deaths have declined now for four straight months in a row in, 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 in Spain. So that concludes the report for Spain for today. Hmm. So that concludes the report for Spain for today. Move on to India.
Oh, let's keep this important for long now. Well, let's just move on to. Uh, Did we do India? I can't remember now. I just, I just lost track of my mind here. Eh, let's see what happens anyway. Maybe not. Hmm. Anyway, you can see that India has had 13.05 million cases with a plus 365 days, 123,680 deaths. You can see that uh, And you can see here that uh, Okay, you can see here that uh, that India's 2022 cases have passed uh, uh, 2021's COVID-19 cases like a standing still, so to speak, if you pardon the expression. Uh, let's see. But the good news is deaths are still lagging behind the 2021 totals. And as of June the 27th, uh, India was averaging 15,277 cases per day and 26.4 deaths per day. You can see even they had a slight bubble here. Uh, these numbers are still pretty doggone low, okay? Look how nice and all these deaths are over here. Now, of course, this is a little misleading because June was a little higher than the previous three months, but still pretty doggone low for, the, for total cases. What you got over here is June, June was the fourth month in a row we saw a decline in COVID-19 deaths in India, okay? Let's go and wrap up this report for India then. Just keep this report wagon rolling along here. Let's go to uh, Israel now. So for the previous 365 days, Israel's had 3.5 million cases, 4,532 deaths. You can see that, uh, that, that you know, in the first quarter this year, uh, 2022, COVID 19 cases went a little crazy on us here in Israel. And even deaths have passed the 2022 total deaths. But you can look over here, you can see we had, did have this long declining pattern here. As of June of 27th, uh, Israel's averaged 11,035 cases per day and 6.7 deaths per day. So that's pretty doggone low. Did have this increase over the previous four weeks. Hopefully this is the beginning of a new downward trend for July. And you can see deaths were still pretty low. This, this line here is 50. So for all this period here, most of this period here, they were 50 or, or, there were 50 or fewer deaths per week, okay? And you can see, unfortunately, that well, this is the most this is the most number of, of cases out of the previous three months. Okay. But this, but June was the fourth month in a row we saw a decline in COVID nineteen deaths in Israel. Okay.
That's Israel. Let's, let's move on along here to Portugal. So you can see that Portugal for the previous 365 days has had, uh, what, 4.3 million cases, 7,053 deaths. You can see that the 2022 cases are just, you went by 2021's like, as we see, like it was standing still because it was standing still. And deaths have also passed 2021 total deaths. We had a big speed bump here, but now, the, now, they've, now they've fallen back down to 8,032 cases per day on average and 22 deaths per day for Portugal. Again, big increase here. All we do, have a, we do seem to be in the middle of a downward trend again here, overall downward trend for cases. And unfortunately, it's, it's still kind of hard. It, it still looks like, uh, well, hopefully this is the beginning of a new downward trend. Hopefully this last week is the beginning of a new downward trend. And the final downward trend for, for Portugal in terms of COVID-19 deaths. You can see that over here, you know, June's death cases were, well, it was the uh, one, two, three, four, was the fourth most of the previous 12 months. And June, June was the third month in a row we saw a, uh, an increase in COVID 19 deaths in uh, Portugal also. Okay? Okay, let's keep this report rolling along here now with Sweden. And you can see a Sweden's average uh, has had for the, 300, for the previous 365 days. It's at 1.43 million cases, 4,499 deaths. You can see that this year's cases have just, just blown right by 2021's cases. And deaths have passed up 2021 deaths also. And you can over here, you see over here the actual numbers are fairly low. For, as of 627, Sweden was averaging 490 cases per day. but only 4.4 deaths per day. So the, the Sweden is really doing okay. Yeah, cra look how crazy those Sweden's case counts are here. And look at this long declining pattern here in terms of COVID-19 deaths in Sweden, below 50 per week. And you can see here June, well, June is very close to being a one, two, three, four, fifth months in a row we saw a decline in the COVID-19 cases in Sweden. And it is the fourth month in a row we see a decline in COVID-19 deaths in, in Sweden also. Okay? Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. Okay, now for the star of our show, the U.S. Okay, for the previous experience 65 day, the U.S. has had approximately 54 million cases, 400, let's say 416,000 deaths. 2022 cases, of, as you can see, has passed 2021 COVID-19 deaths. The good news is 2022 COVID-19 deaths have not caught the 2021 total deaths yet. We have seen a slight increasing pattern here. Slowly, cases have been declined, so right now, it's, as of uh, June the 27th, uh, U.S. is averaging 107,945 cases per day. The deaths are down to 380 per day. Okay, and this line here is 1 million. See, so we've been under a million cases per week here for a long time now. Okay. Deaths. Deaths are hovering right around the, the 2,500 mark, 2,500 mark here. And you can see that June, unfortunately June is, a, is a, what, the fourth month in a row we had a decline in COVID-19 cases in the U.S. But the good news is it is the one, two, three, June is the fifth month in a row we've seen a decline in COVID-19 deaths. So we don't want to, and we don't want to overlook that, 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 uh, that milestone. Five straight months ago, the kind and, and reported COVID-19 deaths, okay? That's the one I want you to focus on. Okay, so that does conclude all of our reports for today. Thank mm -hmm. you.